We are off and running with Michelle Schneider, the director of the Market Gauge Group. Good to see you there, Michelle. And our stimulus talks and what's happening in D.C. holding up the stock market. Well, what we saw last week was that we have some creaky boards in the floor that can easily be shaken up and break if we don't get one of two things or both things ideally. Number one would be obviously the $1.9 trillion stimulus package passed now from the House to the Senate. And two, what the Federal Reserve can do other than basically nothing except for quantitative easing in case those yields start to creep up. Market got nervous about both of those things. So if both things manage to hold up, the, tr the trillion, uh, $1.9 trillion passes and the Fed can actually keep those yields down, then I think, yeah, we, we could actually continue to fly on to new highs. It was a, just a temporary blip on some fear about the lack of accommodation, which the market is very used to and went through kind of a withdrawal without it. What about GameStop and AMC? Both of those stocks are back in play. GameStop, there was actually some fundamental news, which Roaring Kitty came out with, basically saying that they are looking into online gaming. And there's actually an online betting site called Gamble. Uh, and that helped it as well from a fundamental standpoint. Then it brought in all the buyers, of course. And since the hedge funds look like they went short again, they got a good short squeeze. And the same thing with AMC. They did announce in New York they would open up movie theaters to about a 25 percent capacity. But the rest of the country is actually doing better, including here in Santa Fe. So I think the prospects of movies coming back, although there are some people say they'll never go to the movies again, but what have you, I think they will. That's why you're seeing both of those stocks with the benefit of the short squeeze and the attention of the Reddit group doing well. So what's your trade of the day? I would continue to look at the cannabis stocks. Uh, we like Tilray. We're still in Tilray. We're looking to add to it. Uh, it's trading right now close to about $26 a share. I think if it can get through $26 to $26.50 a share and hold, I think it can go right back up. Virginia is passing legal we weed, and now New Mexico is could be right on the heels of it. So the trend is definitely there. All right, Michelle, thank you so much. Thank you, Angie. For more Business First AM, check us out on social media. We're on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. And go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.